Baringo County is one of Kenya's largest producers of goat meat, with around half of the population involved in goat production. Goats are well adapted to this dry land environment and do well even in periods of drought when other livestock such as cows and sheep are suffering. But in recent years, climate change has caused the droughts to get worse, meaning there is less forage for the goats to feed on. So I've come to meet our expert Solomon Kerieng from Baringo County office to find out what can be done to support the goats of Baringo County. So, so Solomon, what are the advantages of keeping goats while the climate changes? The goats can, can withstand even a harsh drought. Cattle and sheep will die or they can move out, but goats, they don't move, they don't migrate. If they sell one, they get uh, a, a one pack of, uh, of maize, one pack of maize, which is 90 kilos, is equivalent to one goat. So it is a livelihood here. Yeah. Yeah. And also even the school fees, even clothing, they rely, they entirely rely on goats. And they are easy to manage. Easy to manage, and also it's accessible to all members of the community. Ladies and men can participate in keeping goats. Mm -hmm. and they can proudly own. But in the case of large stock like cattle, it is only owned by the men. Mm -hmm. So it is very easy, it is very gender friendly. The goats are a wonderful resource for the whole community. But what can farmers do then to look after them while the climate changes? So Simon, mm -hmm. yes, sir. how do you feed your goats with this climate change? How have you adapted to it? What uh, we have decided as farmers is to reduce the number of goats. Uh, because of climate change? Because of climate change. There is no trees for process. The grazing land decreases. Solomon, is that a wise decision for farmers to reduce the stock? Farmers believe in having as many animals as possible, but the problem is that the quality of those animals are really very poor because of inbreeding and because they lack uh, enough feed, they have become very small. Mm -hmm. So our advice to farmers is to improve the breeds because right now they have the small East Africa goats ranging from 10 kilos to 15 kilos. But if they can improve, they, it can go up to even 50 kilos. 50 kilos? Yes. Yeah. From one goat? From one goat. It can sell that one between 8,000 to 12,000. But um, the small East Africa goat, it sells from 1,500 to hardly 3,000. Mm -hmm. So a good breed can fetch higher more amount of money. So one good goat of good breed is equivalent to 10? Yes, to 10. To 10 normal breeds. Yes. And those 10 can eat a lot, can't yes. they? Yes. Whilst th that one goat will feed very little because yeah, you can yeah. be able to manage it yeah, and manage maintain it, it yes. well. Yes. Mm. Good. Which is the best breed that you recommend that farmers have? Yeah, the best breed in this region is the gala goats. Gala goats? Yes. Where do the farmers get that kind of breed from? They can go to northeastern part of Kenya, like Isholo, whereby gala goats are predominant there. So they can purchase from farmers from there, and then they bring it this way. And also we have got Calro Research Institute within Maricat, within Paringo uh, South. Do you have gala goats? Because of the advice of all my expert, I'm going to find one, look for one. Now, we can't speak about feed without water. Where do your goats get the water from? Because they are trekking far away to the community grazing field. On their way, they pass through the canal to drink water there and go. Yeah. What are the disadvantages of your goats going to the community water to drink? They meet with many goats from other villages. Others, they are suffering from diseases like CCPP. And then the presence of wildlife are there again. And they are the carriers of ticks. And they will spread tick-borne diseases to our livestock. That is a big challenge. Uh -huh. And again, worms. They will contract worms there. So our farmers, I would advise them, vaccination is the best answer. Another point is to do regular deworming throughout the year. For more information on vaccination and deworming for goats, call iShamba and find out where you can get supplies near you. So they shouldn't overstock yeah. and they should get good breeds. Breed, yes. Yes. So remember to manage your goats as the climate changes. One, keep less goats. Two, get good breeds that are hardy and gives you more meat and money. And three, vaccinate and warm your goats.